All right, guys, let's talk about something a little bit on the lighter side for a little bit, shall we? So, um, this is actually something that I noticed when I watched Godzilla King of Monsters. Um, I noticed when I watched the movie that there was this one cabin that you see by a lake early on in the movie that looks very similar. It looks almost exactly like the cabin that we see in Avengers Endgame, Tony Stark's cabin out by the lake. And um, I was like what <laughs> i i noticed it and i was like man that looks a lot like tony stark's cabin so um i actually just was thinking about this today and stuff um and i was like you know what i'm gonna see if i can look into this a little bit and uh it looks like i am not the only person that uh that thinks that so it was actually just announced um that tony stark's cabin is um is actually you can actually rent it out or something on airbnb which is kind of interesting um anyway and so i was like looking through here and stuff and i noticed that some people are talking about the uh godzilla king of monsters cabin and stuff uh so it says here like uh let me see let me see let me see when you make a movie you can do and you can you can and do change all kinds of small and simple details like that may also be front door versus back door that or the entire shot was actually re reverse but you would have no way to notice on screen the same cabin was also used in godzilla king of monsters both filmed in atlanta um and then uh it's people are like yes i recognize the house instantly in godzilla king of monsters i said out loud that's tony stark's house which is really funny because that's exactly what i was thinking when i watched uh, godzilla king of monsters as well um glad i wasn't the only one who noticed and tony stark's daughter well the younger version of millie anyways and that's really interesting because when i looked her up it is indeed the the girl who plays uh tony stark's daughter happens to also play young madison in godzilla dum 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 godzilla and avengers connected sharing is the same universe confirmed <laughs> it's actually a thing everybody um <clears throat> so yeah i found this very very interesting and then uh somebody shared here a picture showing both of the cabins together and stuff uh you know as far as like the actual cabin goes they look almost exactly the same in every single way obviously uh here we have like a tree right here which is different um than endgame i believe if i remember right from watching the movie but you know that's all something that can always be removed by people or added in or whatever and stuff so you know besides that like these cabins are exactly the same and even the interior of the cabin is exactly the same when you see the interior scenes from both movies so I just found this really fascinating, really interesting. Uh, I know this is a really, really stupid video, <laughs> um, but uh, but I just found it really interesting, so I wanted to make a video about it. Um, and uh, you know, I I was like, you know, it would be really funny if if uh, there was like something where both the universes were connected in some way. And uh, now now you can officially say that Godzilla and Avengers share the same uh, same universe and stuff. So anyway. Just a just really interesting thing I wanted to point out. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let me see here. Yeah, you can see here another like shot here of the cabin, um, and it looks it looks exactly the same as the cabin from um, <clears throat> from uh, Godzilla as well. I'm gonna see if I can find Godzilla cabin. I don't know if that's gonna pull anything up. Um, King, uh, let's see, King of Mons of monsters cabin okay it's probably not gonna pull, in, pull anything up for that but uh <clears throat> but anyway really really fun stuff what's this oh this this is a different cabin or something i guess anyway guys i just thought that was interesting so i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said this was just kind of a lighter video i wanted to make for you guys i'm not going anywhere okay i'm going to continue to make videos on youtube don't worry i'm i'm not going to be slowing down on that at all uh, i'm going to continue to make videos for you guys here on youtube i am also streaming on twitch since i can't stream on youtube right now so yeah if you guys want to go follow me at on twitch you are more than welcome to do that and i would greatly appreciate that so uh, I'll leave I'll leave a link in the description or something. So thank you so much for your support, and I will talk to you all very soon in another video. Talk to you later. Bye.